Anemia is a deficiency in haemoglobin within the blood. This could be due to a reduction in red blood cells in the blood or a reduction in haemoglobin within the red blood cells. A diagnosis of anemia can be made when there's less than 130 grams per litre of haemoglobin for males or less than 120 grams per litre of haemoglobin for females. A parameter that can be used to classify the different types of anemia is the MCV or mean corpuscle volume, which is essentially the size of the red blood cell. This can be calculated by looking at the hematocrit over the total amount of red blood cells per litre. If the average size of the red blood cell is less than 80 femtoliters, this is considered small and a microcytic anemia. If the average size of the red blood cell is between 80 to 100 femtoliters, this is normal, this is a normocytic anemia. And if the red blood cells on average is larger than 100 femtoliters, this is a macrocytic anemia. The microcytic anemias are usually due to a dysfunction in the way that the haemoglobin is produced. One common subtype of macrocytics are the iron deficiency anemia. This is due to a lack in iron, which then can't be produced into the haemoglobin. Another common form of microcytic anemias are the thalassemias. These are essentially where you have a genetic mutation of the protein in the haemoglobin, which causes a production problem and the red blood cell results being small. With a normocytic, the two common categories are either a destruction or a production problem. With the destruction, the two common forms of normocytic destruction issues is either acute blood loss or hemolytic anemia where the body kills off excessive amounts of red blood cells. For the production forms, this could be due to chronic kidney disease or leukemia and anaplastic anemia. Finally, for the macrocytic anemias, this is where there's a problem with the red blood cell maturing. Two common subtypes of the macrocytic anemias is a deficiency in B12 or folate, which are important constituents for allowing the red blood cells to mature.